Did you know that spotted hyenas have a more powerful bite than a lion? Forget what you've heard of these animals. They are some of the smartest, toughest and most misunderstood predators on the planet. Time to talk raw power. Spotted hyenas have a bite force that's off the charts. Over 1100 PSI. That's stronger than a lion's chomp and enough to turn bones into dust. For their size, they punch way above their weight class. A lion, twice as heavy, doesn't even match that jaw strength. Their jaws are a superpower. With teeth built like industrial shears, they slice through hides and crush skeletons like it's popcorn. This isn't just a cool fact, it's why they can eat what others can't, turning leftovers into a feast. This is due to specialized teeth and a robust skull, enabling them to consume almost every part of their prey, including bones. And get this, their heart is massive, twice the size of a lion's relative to their body. Pair that with a tank-like build, and you've got an endurance beast that can hunt, fight, and chew through anything in its path. Bonus weirdness, female hyenas have pseudo male private parts. It's a reproductive quirk so bizarre that ancient folks thought they swapped genders. They don't, but it's still nature's wildest curveball. Now let's shred a big myth. Hyenas aren't just trash pickers. They're pure killers. 90% of their meals come from their own hunts. These guys are apex predators with teamwork that'd make a sports coach jealous. They aren't the scavengers you normally see on video. Picture this. A pack of hyenas spots a wildebeest. They don't just charge in, they strategize. They isolate the weak ones, then chase them down with insane stamina, cruising at 10 kilometers per hour or six miles per hour for many kilometers, or blasting up to 60 kilometers per hour or 37 miles per hour in bursts. It's like a freaking horror movie where the villains never stop coming. They're brainy too. Hyenas have outsmarted lions, snagging their kills with sly moves. In some places, lions actually mooch off hyenas more than hyenas mooch off lions. Who's the real scavenger now? Hyenas leverage both individual and group tactics. When hunting alone, they target smaller prey like ground birds or small mammals with a success rate of about 15%. However, in groups, their success rate surges to 74%. Impressive stuff. Let's kick things off with how these hyenas roll. They're not loners, they live in clans. And here's the wild part, the females run the show. Yip, it's a matriarchy. The top female is the queen, and even the lowest ranking lady bosses around the highest ranking male. And the females, interestingly, are larger and more aggressive than the males. Quite a difference compared to a lion pride, don't you think? Who here thought those large hyenas you've seen on TV were males this whole time? Comment below and let me know what you think. Males weigh around 45 to 58 kilograms, or 99 to 127 pounds, and the female's fighting weight is around 54 to 68 kilograms, or 119 pounds to 149 pounds. These clans can swell to 80 members, like a chaotic family empire. They've got a pecking order tighter than a military squad, but they're also super social, greeting each other with goofy rituals, playing, and even taking turns watching the cubs. The hierarchy is nepotistic, with cubs inheriting their mother's rank at birth. For instance, if a female is high-ranking, her offspring automatically outrank adult females subordinate to their mother. This structure ensures that dominance passes down the female line with the youngest female cub often becoming the new matriarch upon the current matriarch's death or dispersal. Hyenas exhibit intelligence that rivals many primates, a fact underscored by their social complexity and problem-solving skills. The research suggests that their cognitive abilities are shaped by living in large, intricate social groups akin to primate societies. There was an interesting study conducted by Duke University and published in 2009 that highlighted their prowess in cooperative problem-solving. In this Duke experiment, captive pairs of spotted hyenas were tasked with tugging two ropes in unison to access a food reward, such as bone chips and a sticky meatball, positioned on platforms three meters or 10 feet above ground. 
The design ensured cooperation, as both hyenas needed to pull simultaneously to open a trap door. The results were striking. Three pairs solved the task without any prior training, with the first pair succeeding in less than two minutes. Pretty amazing results considering no prior training. Now experienced hyenas even assisted less experienced partners, demonstrating a level of social learning and cooperation. This contrasts with chimpanzees, who often require extensive training for similar tasks and may struggle with cooperation. The study, published online in the October issue of Animal Behaviour, suggests that hyenas' social hunting strategies in the wild, where they use vocalizations like whoop for coordination, are similar to their laboratory rope test performance. This indicates that their social structure, living in clans with up to 80 individuals, has likely driven the evolution of their cognitive abilities, particularly in social intelligence. Hyenas' communication is equally impressive, with a vocal repertoire that includes over 14 different sounds, each serving distinct social functions. Their most recognizable call, often dubbed the laugh, is a high-pitched <laughs> giggle, typically emitted when they are excited or nervous, such as during competitive feeding or when threatened. However, this is just one part of their complex language. Research into their vocalizations, such as a 2008 study presented at the Acoustical Society of America, reveals the significance of softer sounds like groans observed in intimate social situations. Groans, similar to a cow's moo, are used when hyenas approach each other or when mothers call their cubs from dens. This study, conducted with a captive colony in Berkeley, California, elicited groans by presenting unfamiliar cubs, meaty bones, or an empty cage. Finding the cubs elicited more groans, and with mother's calls to their own cubs being more tonal and potentially higher pitched. Acoustic analysis separated groans into two classes. Cub-oriented groans were higher pitched and more tonal, while male calls were always higher pitched than female calls, suggesting gender-specific variations. Long distance communication is facilitated by whoops, loud calls that can carry up to five kilometers, used for coordinating clan activities or signaling to rivals. A 2022 study published in Proceedings of the Royal Society B Biological Sciences found that whoops contain individual signatures with frequency measures like mean frequency and call duration being key for identification. This was confirmed by a machine learning technique called Random Forests, as detailed in a 2023 article on the Conversation website, studying hyenas in the Maasai Mara National Reserve, Kenya, since 1988. Have a look-see at our killer whale video for another misunderstood animal, and please like and subscribe.